Congratulations on purchasing the cart style charcoal grill and welcome to the next grill family. Before we begin assembling your new grill, reference your owner's manual to make sure all of its parts are accounted for. Note that you'll need a Phillips head screwdriver and adjustable wrench to complete the assembly. If you have any questions or concerns during the assembly process, please call the customer service line on your screen. Let's do this. We'll begin by attaching your grill's front cart legs to the bottom panel. Align the front lip of the bottom panel with the two holes located on the bottom of each front cart leg and secure each leg in place with two A screws. Repeat these steps for the rear cart legs, this time using only one A screw per leg to secure. Next, stand your grill cart upright and loosen the two pre-assembled screws located on the inside of your two rear cart legs. Once loosened, find your triangular brackets and slide them into place like so. Then, re-tighten the pre-assembled screws and secure using two B screws per bracket. Next, we'll install the wheels to the left side of the cart by inserting the wheel axle through the holes on the bottom of the left cart legs. Then secure each wheel to the wheel's axis using one G-nut and one D-washer apiece. Once your wheels are secure, attach cart feet to the two remaining cart legs. With the cart assembled, we'll now carefully set the charcoal bowl assembly on top and secure it in place using 12 A screws from the inside of the bowl or three at each cart leg. Next, find your ventilation adjustment brackets and install them on each side of the charcoal bowl assembly. You'll need one F screw and one E washer per bracket. Next, we'll assemble the side shelf by installing two triangular brackets on its bottom side using two B screws apiece. After that, loosen the two pre-assembled screws located on the right side of the charcoal bowl assembly. Then, slide your side shelf into place like so, retightening the pre-assembled screws and secure in place using two A screws from the inside of the charcoal bowl assembly. Next, find your grill's firebox hinges and mount them to the rear lip of the charcoal bowl assembly using two A screws apiece. Now, find your charcoal tray hooks and hook them into your charcoal tray like so. Once hooked, carefully lower the charcoal tray into the charcoal bowl assembly. On this grill, there are three different levels for your charcoal rack. Typically, you would begin a cookout with a charcoal rack position at the lowest level due to the freshly lit charcoal burning at its hottest. As the coals cool down, you can move your charcoal rack up the ladder to shorten the distance between the grill's heat source and all the sizzling food. But for now, we'll just leave our charcoal rack at its lowest position. Next, find the temperature gauge and totally remove its pre-assembled screws. Then insert the temperature gauge into the available slot on your main lid and reinstall the pre-assembled screws to secure. Next, we'll install the main lid handle. To do so, remove the two pre-assembled screws found on each end of the handle like so. Then position the handle and its seats over the holes located on the front of the main lid and reinstall the screws from the inside of the lid to secure the handle in place. Next, we'll install two more ventilation adjustment brackets on the sides of the main lid. Just like before, you'll need one F screw and one E washer per bracket. Now, with the main lid flipped upside down, attach the main lid hinges to the rear lip using two more A screws apiece. We'll now carefully set it on top of the charcoal bowl, making sure that the firebox hinges and the main lid hinges align like so. Once they're aligned, you can secure the main lid in place by inserting a C pin and then an H clip through each hinge. Now that the lid is secure, we'll go ahead and open it up so we can angle your grill's warming rack into place using the available holes on the inside of the main lid and charcoal bowl. Then simply set your cooking grid into place.
Your next grill's cart style charcoal grill is now assembled and ready to go. Better call up the neighborhood. Everyone's invited to a next grill cookout.